Hi, this is Ned from Pro Tips, and I'm going to show you how to install the dimmer. This is a universal dimmer by Lutron, CL dimmer. It dims LEDs, CFLs, halogens, and incandescents. For those that don't know, CFL is a compact fluorescent light. Um, make sure you buy the correct bulbs. They have to be dimmable bulbs. If you don't, they will flash when you dim the switch, or they just won't dim at all. So start there. Um, this is the switch we're gonna repair. It's actually broken and it happens to be right next to our breaker box. So you're gonna be able to see how I'm working back and forth right here. Let's get started. I'm gonna take my voltage tester and I'm just gonna check. Okay, this is hot, obviously. So we're gonna turn off the breaker, make sure that it's not anymore. Okay, we're good to go. Got the green light. I'm gonna start taking this off. So if two black wires, I want to see which one's the hot. I know it's the top one that I separated up here, but I just want to make sure. This happens a lot. You see two black wires. I'm going to turn the breaker back on just to double check. Okay, turning it off, and then I'm going to tag that wire with a piece of electrical tape. So I know. All right. And I'm going to open up my dim pack. It's gonna come with some wire nuts. So the first thing I'm gonna do is attach the blue cap on top of the red wire with the white stripe. Um, this is if we wanna have another light switch in the circuit. Um, and then the next thing I wanna do is attach the green to the ground in here. I'm just gonna double check see what's going on with that. So this is going to be my hot black. And then my neutral. It's going to be red. So I'm going to go ahead and test this. Flip the breaker on, light is working, it is dimming, switch is working on and off, perfect. So we're good to go. I'm gonna go ahead and wrap this up, turning the breaker back off. Don't forget to turn the breaker off, folks. You don't wanna get popped. 110 is no joke. So I really enjoy kind of doing DIY projects. It's not about money a lot of times. It's just a completed task. You did something say hey how'd you do that and you're like who'd you hire you're like I did it it was cool what you did that so nicely shoved these wires back in here all 
All right, so this dim pack came with a couple screws, which is nice of them. Kind of have to work with it to make sure that it's straight. That's why you have these. The holes are a little bit wider, so you can turn them a little bit and whatnot. Ned from Pro Tips. Please, if you enjoyed this video, like and subscribe. If you have any questions or comments, please do that below. Appreciate you guys. We'll see you soon.